Commissioner Lee. Permission to exit stage right, God. And God said, yes, your assignment is done. Now you can leave. So a lot of you left a lot of these jobs and your assignment was finished. Your assignment was over. And God still gave these people time to turn from their wicked ways. I told you, uh, symbolically, the story of Jonah, when he went to Nineveh, people think he went there with a piece of paper and got on the stage and grabbed the mic and did what God told him to do in five minutes. All right. How y'all doing? I know y'all don't recognize me, but my name is Jonah. My name is Jonah. Uh, I come from the, uh, uh, there are laws in the universe. If you know what the universe is, people of Nineveh. Okay, I know we don't have school books for y'all yet. But there's something out here called balance. And if y'all keep doing this stuff and asking these entities on the spiritual realm to help you against each other, all that spell work is going to bring a lot of bad karma to where you live. And all of you are going to be destroyed. Okay, that was my speech. God sent me. I'm done. All right, and I'm out. Jonah, throw the mic down. No, it did not happen like that. Jonah had to live amongst those people for a while because he had to Christianity, actually uh, Judaism, because Christianity was not created until uh, the birth of Christ, of course, you know, and then it was a combination of a whole bunch of other things. But uh, I'm here to make an announcement to you all. So uh, I do serve the one true God, okay, whether you know it or not, maybe you never had an opportunity uh, to be told before that what you're doing is wrong, uh, to attack other people uh, in a low vibration. Uh, there are laws in the universe. If you know what a universe is, people of Nineveh. Okay, I know we don't have school books for y'all yet, but there's something out here called balance. And if y'all keep doing this stuff and asking these entities on the spiritual realm to help you against each other, all that spell work is going to bring a lot of bad karma to where you live and all of you are going to be destroyed. Okay, that was my speech. God sent me. I'm done. All right, and I'm out. Jonah, throw the mic down. No, it did not happen like that. Jonah had to live amongst those people for a while because he had to talk and converse and go back and forth and explain and try to shed light and try to open their eyes. Stop acting like an animal. Let me help you raise your consciousness. Why would you do this to this person if you don't want them to do it to you? Hey, you're doing this only because you're jealous. Hey, now you're attacking me. It didn't happen in five minutes and he got back on a boat and left. He didn't give a five minute speech and then everybody saw the light and they changed. Jonah had to stay right in that place and he had to literally live amongst those people as a beacon of light and continue to speak the truth to them and to show by example how you should love, how you should do unto others as you would have them do unto you. And it hurt because they kept doing black magic on him. They kept gossiping about him, setting him up, following to his house, throwing shit at his head. head. Yes. They didn't accept Jonah or what he had to say. There was no better friend. Oh. 
आपको क्या नाम है